Hello friends, welcome to OC's office page. Today in this video session, we will discuss about uh, how to integrate a chat GPT and their completion features in uh, CSA publication. So today I will demonstrate this by with the example. So first of all, we need to create a API key for uh, open API. So we will open our open AI website and then uh, we log in by with any uh, emails with your personal email and uh, after logging this uh, dashboard will be displayed and then you can go to your uh, account and then click on uh, view view api key uh, here i already created one api for uh, sample and i will delete this secret key after creating this video so this will not work at your own when you try it so you can create your own api key for uh, use this uh, demonstration so first of all i create a one blank project for a console application this is the dotnet framework console application currently this is the blanks so first of all uh, we need to install a nuget package for open api so i am going to this this package manager console and then here we install the open api package package then we write uh, open ai install package open ai sorry it's open ai then press uh, enter button so this will install the latest open ai sdk now after that i'm writing one more namespace for open ai it's open ai underscore api and now uh, i'm writing here uh, console like a uh, right line here like i'm uh, we provide any questions for that open ai like uh, i'm writing uh, what is the meaning of life like uh, simple questions for test and then uh, we create one variable for open ai equal to new open ai underscore api and then here uh, we we provide a api key it's uh, open ai api so here this will require the api key so we can copy this from here from for this uh, secret key so i am using that secret key here and then then we uh, creating a completion request so i am writing a completion request equal to uh, we creating one object for this and then it contain a different uh, properties like uh, uh, compiled from stop echo this will, uh, when you move the cursors so this will uh, provide the descriptions about their properties so like echo is uh, echo back to prompt means it's showing a prompt message uh, what you want to ask from uh, open api and there is a different properties you can check this by your own providing their tokens model names means which which model you want to uh, use in open api for your answers so there are different options available for this so first of all uh, we provide a prompt means i'm providing a questions for this click like i am writing this questions for open api and then we provide here a model for this for which model uh, i am using so it's uh, open ai for demonstration i am using uh, uh, davinci text so open ai and that's for api dot model dot this will showing a different models here 
so for this demonstration i am like using this dimensi text and this will here describe the models like a uh, most capable gpt3 model can do any task that uh, models can do with higher quality and longer and better instruction following within text so like i am using you can check with your own with different models and uh, their output now now uh, we providing like a where completions we getting the result where completions is equal to open ai dot completions dot dot create create completion there is providing a two uh, variables one is the completions like another one is like a format this will provide a format features also completions provide a multi line answers and uh, if i use com completion async then this will provide only single output single line of like for demonstration i am firstly use this completion async and then use this completion request now i am using that for each like where completion and then completions dot result dot uh, completion and then we can write here like a console dot write then here it's a completion dot uh, text and then i am writing a recons console dot red line for uh, reading that text then it's a control control s for save this application so uh, we run this application here this will showing a first message that we write in and this uh, open ai provide the uh, question of this answer like the meaning of life each question that is impossible to answer definitely and we can run this application again and again this will provide a different different answers according to their uh, algorithms so if uh, we run application in different times then this will provide different different answers so if we change like a completion async and if i am changing for multi-line like completions then this will provide a multi line multi line answer for this and like a default is five lines means uh, this will describe the answer in five different answers we can change the default uh, outputs like here like i am setting it as a 10 so this will provide a 10 line of answer for this uh, questions we can change their different types of models here like i'm changing something like any different uh, text embedding so it will provide a, a did different line of answer different types of answers different formats so this will depend on the models something like that that changing like a different answers different models and we can also control the temperatures like this container temperature completion request dot temperature temperatures like a, it's higher value means model will take more risk means number of iterations to provide your uh, answers so 0 0.9 for more creative applications and zero or one with well defined answers like i'm changing a temperate temperatures like uh, 0.9 and again run this application this will showing a different different answers according to their temperatures so and you can also there is another variables also available models eco penalty you can use different properties and 
check your answers according to that so one more so like is top of p this is the alternative to sampling with temperature and uh, called nucleus sampling and you can use either temperature or or top of p this uh, this can be said according to your need so this is a complete some sample and simple demonstration for how you can use a chat gpt in your csap applications so i will try to demonstrate and uh, if you like my videos and for more creative uh, topics so uh, by that we can create a videos on that so please click on uh, subscribe button and for getting a latest updates also click on notification bell so thanks thanks for watching we will meet in next video session